Now, you may remember this from the start of this section. We had the area of a trapezium formula, and it was clearly wrong. So let's now look at this by looking at the dimensions of area and then the dimensions of the right-hand side. So the dimensions of area would be L squared. And the dimensions of the right-hand side, which is 1 half H A times B. Now, the 1 half is dimensionless. And then you've got H, which is a length, times by a length, times by a length. And so that's L cubed. Now, L squared is not equal to L cubed. And so that means that it is not dimensionally consistent.